So this question says the graph of 7x plus 2y equals negative 31 in the xy plane has an x-intercept at a0 and a y-intercept at 0b, where a and b are constants. What is the value of b over a? Okay, so in order to find an x-intercept, you just simply replace y with 0. So let's do that. So I have 7x plus, instead of 2y, I'm going to call that 2 times 0 equals negative 31. That means this whole term goes to 0 which means I'd be left with 7x equals negative 31, which of course I can divide both sides by 7, and I'd have x equals negative 31 over 7. So there's my a value. The x-intercept is at a comma 0, so a is equal to negative 31 over 7. Um, then it goes on to say the y-intercept is at 0b. Well, the y-intercept is simply replacing x equals 0, so I'm going to do the same thing. Here, instead of 7x, I have 7 times 0 plus 2y equals negative 31. Of course, this whole thing becomes 0, which means I really just have 2y equals negative 31. Divide by 2, and I'm left with y equals negative 31 over 2, which, again, is just the b value. Our y here is our y-intercept, so b is equal to negative 31 over 2. The question says, what is the value of b over a? Well, b over a would be negative 31 over 2 over negative 31 over 7. Whenever I have a complex fraction like that, I like to write them horizontally, negative 31 over 2, and then do the horizontal division sign divided by negative 31 over 7. When you're dividing fractions, the first fraction remains the same. The division becomes multiplication and you write the reciprocal of the second fraction. So you flip it over. I can cross cancel these, which now become positive ones. One times seven is seven, two times one is two. So therefore seven halves is the correct answer.